Oh my gosh, Den of Desires! That's what I call my bedroom. <laughs> that's, uh, that's what I call my bedroom. Anyways, it's Yakuza Zero again today. And we're back with Goro, Goro Majima. I guess we were with Goro, right? Yeah, we've been with Goro Majima for a while, actually. Um, oh, hey, him, Sagawa, on. How are you doing, pal? Hmm? Uh... Okay. I actually... I don't know how I just now realized that I probably had my microphone on, uh, way too loud. So, I guess I'll be using my indoor voice today. Sorry, guys. It's just the way it goes. It's the way the news goes. For whatever reason, Realtek Audio, um... Audio, uh, um, uh, selector thingy, or whatever, just kind of like tanks my microphone pickup volume, or whatever, uh, or output volume, I guess. It's outputting to the computer, but it's not like it's internal, so I don't know if you can really consider that output, you know. Uh, speaking of putting out, your mom, um, but, yeah, it's just kind of weird. I, I, I don't want to have to figure out audio quality every single episode. And I really probably should just, uh, <laughs> just record microphone audio and game audio in two different channels and then mix them together. <laughs> but, you know, why would I do something so convenient when I could just not, um, yeah. Speaking of mixing, though, I've been thinking, well, you know what it really is? It starts with, a. Uh, have been listening to my dad's CD playlist in the car on the way to work, right? And every time I come across, every now and again, I'll come across a song, and I'll either think that it's a different song, legitimately, or I'll just kind of mix it in my head with a different song anyways. So I've already come up with a couple, and I might actually make them. Um, and don't get me wrong, I, I haven't done the research on whether or not they actually exist already. Uh, I probably should have, you know. But, uh, you know, I might just do it anyways, because, let's be honest, I'm not going to say that I'm great at mixing, but some of the existing mixes, or mashups, or whatever, are just kind of, you know, you just put the vocals on the uh, instruments of the other song, and then uh, pitch it down, and make sure it's the right uh, tempo. And there you go, that's the whole thing! I'm like, well, you know, that's a little boring. <laughs> like, uh, okay, uh... Cool, yeah, the uh, the the one part in um, Pump Up Kicks sounds a little bit like the one part in Feel Good Ink. How about that? Uh, the rest of the song, though, I mean, uh, after a while, it just kind of feels uh, like I've heard it before. <laughs> uh, something like that. Maybe the, maybe it's because I've listened to those mashups before. But what I'm thinking, I'm thinking you start out with. Uh, Freaking all aboard ah, 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 from Crazy Train, right? Right? And it goes into the opening of Feel Good Ink, and you get the uh, the uh, first verse of Pumped Up Kicks, and then at the end of that, it does a reversal for the chorus, and you get the. Um, right? Because the chorus of uh, the chorus of Feel Good Ink is the one about the the part about the windmill, right? And then you get the chorus, right? And then you do another reversal for the second verse of Pumped Up Kicks, and then then it goes in, it goes into the Crazy Train guitar solo. No, I'm not. Am I ready for what? What am I ready for? Oh boy. No, I am not ready. Let me go get any amount of health up items. Please, please, please. I really need to get literally... Okay, drugstore. Quick, drugs. Drugs. Need drug. Um. So yeah, and I have, I've been... Considering even putting the rap portion of uh, Feel Good Ink into and mixing it into the guitar solo of Crazy Train, <laughs> and it would just 
it would just be terrible. <laughs> it would probably be terrible. Um, oh my gosh. Taurine. Prime you for... I don't know what it does, though. Turmeric. You know, we like turmeric. Turmeric's nice and good and all that. Uh, please tell me that there is... Oh, good. Whew. I'm going to be getting a lot of these. I only have so many inventory slots. Okay, so taurine is a heat charge up thing. I'll probably just get um, the toughness stuff because in all honesty, what the heck? I feel like this is the kind of story item that I'm going to need eventually. So let me, I'm, no, never mind. Also, what? Why am I just carrying, you know, I probably should have thought about how the inventory has limited slots before I picked up eight things of pocket tissues. I understand that's like the running gag or whatever, where I'm like, oh, I need some pocket tissues. Uh, let's get two of those and three of these. And I guess I uh, can only buy... What? Ah. Oh my gosh, hold on. When did I get five stamina royales? I don't need five stamina royales. I'm not worried about heat, really. Like, as, as much as I understand that that's a really important part of this game, uh, I'm not very good at this game, so you know what? I'm not just going to do the whole pay-to-win thing. That ain't my ting, pal. I'll just be bad normally. Um, yeah. But, I was thinking of another one while I was in Dakar. Hey! Men in Black! I can show off to, a uh, um, whatever that guy's name is. I literally forgot already. Hey, pal, how about... Okay, never mind. Hey, hold on. Where did the rest of these guys come from? You know what? I feel like this calls for breaker style. I also probably need to disarm this guy. So let's just... Oh, wow. Oh my gosh. Nope, not happening. See, that's perfectly fine. Ah, oh, and that's perfectly fine too. I gotta say, I completely forgot how to use... Okay, I completely forgot how to use, um... How to use, um, thug style, you know? So I, sh I should probably figure that out. I literally forgot. Where's the last guy, huh? Oh, okay, there he is. Nope. Really, dude. This guy's just completely out of it, man. I remember that I can use the, uh... I can do the, um, freaking four, five, okay. There's, like, the freaking, like, the one where you put your freaking fingers up their nose. I know how to do that. I don't know how to do anything else. And it doesn't really look like you can do much else besides just put your fingers up their nose, you know? Yes, that does make me sad. Dude, shut up. Uh, yes, I'm set, fellas. Let's go beat up some guys. Because I don't do that enough already. I really don't. There are even episodes where I don't beat anybody up. And they get more views for some reason. For whatever reason, I guess people like the the uh, the Blackjack episode. <laughs> more than the me beating people up episode. Sheesh. Well, I'm not complaining, I guess. Except that I lost money doing that. I'm not very good at gambling, I guess. Uh, so what was another mashup I thought of? Um... Ah, uh, that's right. Okay, I was thinking of names in my head, because the names are the only way that I can remember them, but then I forget about what the songs are anyways, you know? Like, uh, the one that I was just talking about with was uh, Crazy Good Kicks. That's another thing. The mashup names aren't very good, you know? I don't think Feel Pumped Inc. is a really, is a, is a really good name, you know? Like, sorry, dude. Um, it's a pretty good mix, but it's not the greatest name. I have terrible naming sense in some things, but some things just click. And Crazy Good Kicks. That clicks, alright? Now, I know that it, that doesn't work for just uh, Feel Good Ink and Pumped Up Kicks. I mean, there's like Pumped Up Ink. And that's probably the best you get, and I, I have seen that one, so that's pretty nice. Um, but then I was thinking, you know, Check Yes Panama. Which is, like, a pretty forced name, but again, it's probably the best I can get for mixing Check Yes Juliet and Panama. Which sounds terrible. <laughs> uh, it sounds like it would be hellish to do, and I'm trying to think, I'm trying to think of, like, a third song I can put in there in the same way that I have Crazy Train in Crazy Good Kicks. By I have, I mean I have thought, because I haven't done anything about it yet. Um... There was another one I was thinking of. It was, a. Uh, it, uh... 
I, I really don't remember what it was. All I remember is that I was while I was listening to the song, I was thinking of the. Uh, um, I would walk uh, 500 miles. You know, I guess it's called 500 miles. Oh yeah, he has a gun. I forgot about that. Um, so, yeah. When do I get the gun? The the uh, the gun style. I really need gun style. Hmm. Oh my gosh. They're weird. You're not just built different. You're not built different. You're just different. You're weird. <laughs> oh boy. I'm in their good graces. Are you sure, pal? Well, yeah. You know he does have a bit of a point there. They're the 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 freaking the the. I forgot the name. Never mind. I was gonna mention the uh the uh, uh Anbu right the Anbu Black Ops from Naruto or whatever. But it's never mind. I haven't watched Naruto in a while, anyways. So whatever. I uh, dropped it a little bit at. The part where the uh, the Anbu boy goes with them to um, uh, was that actually when I stopped? I don't remember. Uh, you know, let's just beat these guys up. Maybe that'll jog my memory. Removing their memories will jog mine, I'm sure. Anyways, Yahoo! We. I can really move out out here, you know. Anyways, right. I keep forgetting that there's like a super cool attack move I can do. Um. Anyways, okay. Oh my gosh. Yep. Ow, that's not cool. You know what? We're going back to a uh, breaker style, dude. Not cool, man. Because breaker style can really lay them out, I guess. Sort of, pretty much. I mean, these guys are honestly kind of pushovers. Look at their health bars. Just go and down is the direction that they're going. By the way. Hey, how about that? <laughs> I thought I was the only one in this game that whiffed really, really hard. And you know, it was nice to see somebody else whiffing really, really hard. Also, um, goodbye, sayonara. That's what they say in Nihongo, as they say in Nihongo, aka Japanese. Anyways, ah, sucker. I still think it's kind of weird that, like, you can technically, um, take, like, take the... I, I don't know what the B button is supposed to do, you know? Like, it, it, I get that it's a, like, stance break. Four, five. Okay, pal. There we go. Not if I have anything to say about it, dude. There we go. Very nice. Through another door with you. I wonder if they're gonna cycle through all of the colors. It is the month of June, after all. Okay, there they are. It should be June, though. TBH. Oh! Oh! Hold on. Hold on. I got... There's gotta be something here. All right. We. I mean, come on. I'm just beating the crap out of these guys. And I mean, I can do things like this. And also, I'm not really losing heat all that hard, you know? Hey, pal. You know what? We're just gonna, like, beat him up. Oh, gosh, these guys are big. Okay, well, I, I stand corrected. Well, not that they're not big, but um, that they're, like, really easy to take down, I guess. Anyways, I have a bat. Okay, that kind of hurt a little bit. I'm not a big fan of that guy. I just wanted the guy with the knife. I wanted him to not be there anymore. Okay, I think I did kind of figure out how to combo into that, at least. Oh, boy. I think that was at least kind of worth it. I really need some good timing to combo into the, uh... Okay, I think I do have the timing on comboing out of the... Oh, boy. This looks like I might want a health. Wow, okay. Based on how fast that went up, I'm just gonna assume for a little second here that, uh... Hold on. Take out this knife-throwing nincompoop for a second there. Alright, I understand the problem with uh, slugger style, and it's that you, uh, have some kind of spatial constraint. Oh, the guy in the demon mask! Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I thought the big guy was the guy with the big health bar, but he's not. Oh, okay, I did the wrong thing there. Anyways, how about some breaker? Y'all like, uh, dancing? Oh, jeez. Anyways, this is entirely worth it. This is not worth it at all. Alright. I just wanted to take the one guy down, so this is actually really worth it. And now we're just gonna hit him with a baseball bat over and over again, and it's just gonna work out, because that's how it works. Okay. I'm not gonna lie, that umbrella in the background just kind of materializing out of thin air really scared me for a second, because I thought that that was some kind of indication of me not being alive anymore somehow. Uh, I wouldn't have been too surprised. Which direction do I want to go? Let's say... Oh, never mind. Women? <gasps> Move on? Okay. This is just kind of confusing. It really is the month of June, huh? That's the uh, last thing I'm going to say about the month of June. Oh, yeah. Okay, hold on. That's it. We're going to have a little dance here. Seriously. This is... This is now it's going too far. Um, I wonder how much I can really do feasibly with a... Uh, hey, pal. How would you like to be hurt real bad? Hold on. Uh, one, two, up your nose. Okay. Buckle my shoe, I believe, is the... I can't believe that guy just dodged the baseball bat. Normally you get hit by a baseball bat like that, you know? Hey, pal. Also, I can't believe I just sat here with, like, a three. Hold on. Ah, oh, damn. There we go. That's all I wanted to do. I literally just wanted to take out my bat and hit someone in the head with it. 
Cantam, Cantaman dream. All right. I, I really gotta figure out the timing for that. I kind of thought I got it for a second there. It's like not quite, um, not quite at the level of, uh, just doing it immediately after, which is why it's kind of wacky for me. This guy was scared of me. Let's just take him out, put him out of his misery. Boink. Okay, I got it there. And now we're just gonna take this guy out. Yeah, a nice little bat to the face there. I sure hope I don't have to... I don't have to censor anything, right? Is it now? There's only one of you. Oh, okay, there are more than one of you. Oh, okay, there's a knife-throwing fella somewhere. Oh, okay, I... Here's the man with a knife. You know what? Just because you have a knife, I'm going to take you out as fast as possible. Or AFAP, as they say. They definitely say that. I'm not the only one, right? Okay, I think Slugger style is still pretty good in crowds, because I can swing wildly. Swing for the fences. Swing away, you know? Big fan of the movie signs. I still can't believe the aliens just came to the place that's completely full of water. Isn't it really convenient that they did that? Oh my gosh, Dejambe Flambe. Anyways. Okay. Oh my gosh, they're saying Kono Baka Na or whatever. <clears throat> Kono Dioda! Sorry, my force of habit, truly. Ow. I'm just trying to block, man. I probably should have stayed in Breaker style just because that would have been so much more fun. These guys would have had a lot more fun with me here, you know? Dude. How about taste my steel, pal? And my boot. Lick my boots. Maybe I will forgive you. Yeah, just kidding, that's not happening. This direction. Now this direction. Okay. I'm just gonna preemptively do this, because I think I know how this is gonna go. Ah! This direction. I just have a really good sense- Oh my gosh! Nah, no, okay. I did it wrong. Oh my gosh. Sorry, I was thinking of Nintendo controllers, and uh, that really came out of nowhere for me. Okay. Oh my gosh. Wow, they're just gonna keep on coming, huh? What's with this fun house? What am I looking at, you know? This guy probably still has some knives on him, so I'm not just gonna let him go. Oh yeah. Okay, I really, I really just wanna like put one of these guys through the window, so let me just uh... I still can't believe that that guy is like not- Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ah, uh, I just want to put one of you guys through the window, man. Please, 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 just, just one. Just one of you. Hey, you look nice. You look like you could use a, a, a fine, fine, then, fine. The dancer is coming back out, and he, and he ain't going back in, either. That's right. In the month of June, no less. We're coming out. <sighs> I really just can't stop myself, can I? Okay. It's that time in the episode where I just take the bat out and kick everybody's asses. Oh, no, not more. No more Mulan extras. Hey, actually, that's a pretty good one. I just think I had never used it before because I was in the middle of, a, like, facing a wall. Yep, that'll do it. Hey, hold this. You didn't hold it. Um, darn shame, right? There we go. Very nice. Okay, that's pretty cool. Oh, very nice. I'm still gonna grab one of them, and it's gonna really work out, I'm sure. Ow. All right. Eh. All right, come here, boy. Oh, dang, I pressed the wrong one. Truly a shame. I should have pressed B instead of Y. Oh boy. Oh, okay. Never mind. That's a lot less menacing than it looked. Oh, okay. Never mind. That was a lot more menacing than I thought. Ah. Uh -huh. Hey, pal. I got something for you. It's a chair. Why don't you take a seat? First hands, let me see. Hey, pal. I got something for you. Oh, you can throw people in this game. Hey, pal. Uh, check this out. Boink. Nice. That's actually pretty cool. So is that. Check out my one good eye. It's really nice, isn't it? Got him. We got the toughness to see, fellas. You know what? I am going to. I'm going to put my finger up your nose. It's going to happen, guys. Okay, it didn't happen. I'm very sad that I didn't get my fingers up his nose. Hey, that works. And a good stomp to the face, of course. I feel like once I stopped talking about music, my uh, commentary just went completely downhill, but, you know, that's the uh, the way it goes every now and again. I really don't like that he just kind of, like, hits me with those, and then he doesn't lose them. One, two, three, four, five. Yes, five is the maximum. Was wondering about that. Oh, my gosh. Seriously, every time. I just... I'm just a big fan. I'm a really big fan of doing that. Speaking of big fan... I'm just gonna take one of those now, because Lord knows this is gonna take a while. I'm gonna feel like cutting this up later, and I'm gonna not do it, because, you know, why would I? I wonder if it's acceptable to, like, speed up the, uh, speed up the fighting a bunch of fellas thing. Yeah? Um, uh-huh. Is it just me, or does this guy have stripes on his head? Where is Makoto Makimura? Oh? Or is it Makimura? No, Mu would be a... Uh, Mu... You, you know? So, Muda... Muda da... You know? Anyways... I am not your enemy. Uh... Okay... I mean, the funny clowns did in fact say, uh, you can walk away. Alright. What resolve? Yes, I, I do know that. It seems like every, um, 
group in existence is interested in Makoto Makamura. Makimura. So, um, yeah. Yes, that would be me. I am also interested in her. Sort of. In some kind of way. Oh? Hey, me? Why am I without a trace? I could have sworn I was just operating out out in the uh, out in the open. I was literally a cabaret club owner. I'm a host, dude. Come on. Hmm. Yeah, don't get me wrong. I don't know what's going on either, dude. Don't ask me. Sheesh. Uh. Oh, right. Oh, my gosh. I was thinking of another song mashup. It was, uh, it was Ocean Man. Oh, my gosh. It was, it was, it was something and Ocean Man. And I was thinking about it, and then I thought Stone Ocean Man, which is not this, the mashup that I was thinking of. Uh, but it was, it worked a lot better. And now I can't remember what the original one was. It was, oh my gosh. Um. Uh, oh my gosh, I really wish I could remember. <laughs> I really want to remember. There was, um. Oh, no. I really, I can't for the life of me remember. It was the vocals for Ocean Man. And... So, uh, it wasn't... No. I'm, I'm thinking about it, sorry. I was halfway through thinking that it could have been living on a prayer because it had been like, Ocean Man. Um... Okay, that's just Ocean Man. Hold on. It was basically like the Ocean Man part of Ocean Man. Just pasted on front of another, like, whoa, whoa, you know? That that kind of uh, vocalization, you know? So it'd be like, Ocean Man, halfway there. Ocean Man, they ran on a prayer. Except that doesn't really work. And the one that I was thinking of worked, like, surprisingly well in my head so i don't think that um i was it was something that stupid you know i mean it would have been something really stupid don't get me wrong but it was something like slightly less stupid okay hey pal not cool all right here have my number four you know ah okay never mind he got me pal dang guys this guy can just is he is he putting me in an infinite oh my gosh this guy just jab blocked me not cool oh my here taste that for a second okay i really gotta figure out where the uh oh my gosh i literally just there we go. Oh? Gosh, this guy knows martial arts. Not cool. Ha, ah, I lived. Where's the next quick time, quick time escape? I just want the next... Um, oh my gosh, he's really just gonna do it to me again. Hold on. I gotta chug one of these in the middle of the fight. It's very important. Dude, he's, he's just knocking me. He really knows what he's doing. I gotta say. But has he fought the martial arts known as uh, Yaku, or baseball in the English language? I was say in the criminal justice system. Dear God. That's it. We're going thug. We're going full thug, guys. Here, taste my fingers, if your nose has taste buds, of course, which I don't know that it does, personally. So, the whole uh, thug-style thing didn't work out very well. I think I'm just gonna not do that again, and rely entirely on my cool and epic baseball moves. My cool and epic baseball bat. Except it's really not going very well, and I'm not even allowed to pause. I was stuck in that. I couldn't even pause the game while he was beating the crap out of me there. Okay, hold on. Ah. I think it's, like, right as he hits. Right as it impacts. I really, I mean, I can also just kind of keep him at a distance by doing that over and over again. I don't actually want to do this over and over again, but, like, I can, I was actually keeping pretty good distance by doing it over and over again. He's really wailing on me, dude. It's actually kind of terrifying, but, um, okay, he went down all right. It's a good thing I had all that medicine on me, because that guy did a lot of damage. Sheesh. Do you satisfied, pal? Uh, Lord knows I'm satisfied. Uh, uh, ask your mother. <laughs> yeah, something like that. Yes, it is. Start talking. Who'd you pass her off to, pal? A real estate agent. A real estate agent. A real estate agent. A real estate agent. Oh my gosh. I think we know who it is. Why would they take her to Kamarucho? He... 
<laughs> oh boy. The plot is the key to the Kamarucho revitalization product project. Wow. <laughs> oh my gosh. True though. Yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't exactly want harm to befall her either. Let's just uh Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the car bomb. The car bomb was maybe a bit much for somebody that uh, didn't want to didn't want to cause her harm. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, unorthodox. E very nice. Run by a guy with a bat tattoo on his arm. Uh, no hands. That kind of fella, you know. <laughs> Tajibana data state. Oh boy. Good times. It's all coming together, fellas. Uh, good question. I'm just gonna keep doing it anyways. <sighs> Probably not. But, uh, you know. I need you to kill me. And make it seem like I am very dead. You know it, fellas. Ah, what was it? It was a... Uh, I'm still thinking about that Ocean Man mashup. It, uh, I think Ocean Man may have replaced a name of some kind. Yes! Hand it over! The gun. Gun style. Gunner style. Yes! Finally! Finally! American style. Oh? Um. Uh. Uh. I don't know, man. That, uh. That seems like a bit much for me. I'm not sure how I feel about that. You could just hand it over. We could just we could just say that I stole this gun from you and threatened you and stuff. You know. I only have one eye, man. I can't aim this. I have no death perception. Only death perception. Okay. Why'd you throw it away? You could have at least pocketed it. Come on. Sheesh. I will be going there. True. Oh, and yet you are just about to throw away your life for next to no reason. Oh, well. Ah. I'm seeing a lot of people get shot today, huh? Really should have kept the gun. Yep, uh, pretty much. Um, yeah, yeah, pretty much. That's, uh, let's go with that, yeah? Hey, yep. Here he is. Makoto's new real estate agent. Yeah? When have you ever seen me smile? Actually, never mind. Never mind. Majima smiles like a gosh darn maniac in thug style. So, uh, I gotta remember that. Oh, Tachibana real estate. Kazuma Kiryu, eh? It's all coming together. It's all coming together. Oh my. Who the heck is this Kiryu Kazama fella? Come on. Who in the gosh darn is this real estate agent known as Kiryu? Never heard of him. Hey, 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 you kiss your mother with that mouth? Sheesh. I just played the whole frickin' chapter in one episode. And I'm doing this less than 24 hours before I have to put this up. It's 8.30 the night before. I procrastinated way too hard on this. Anyways, I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna worry about it. We're gonna, we're gonna worry about it on the next episode. Worth 46 grand pianos! 
I can buy 46 grand freaking pianos with this money. I wonder if we can use them as a weapon in this game. If only. Lord knows my playing would be considered gosh darn lethal if this were real life. Anyways. Yeah, I'm going to leave it there. Till next time, like, I'm going to subscribe. Or I will drop 46 freaking grand freaking pianos on you. <laughs> right on your head. It'll go dong, 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 and then 43 more times. Yep. Anyways, goodbye! Yeah, I hope that one. I thought it was pretty funny.